my apologies to us about that i was like you know what let me just put the cards up but i know a lot of you guys are going to want the part two to this okay yeah this person carries a lot of guilt for the way they mistreated you yeah judgment i'm making a decision once and for all to turn this around i told you guys and um i said i see judgment in my third eye it said judgment i'm making a decision once and for all to turn this around so this, this is somebody who learns from their mistakes. They don't want to make the same mistakes anymore. This is somebody who wants to make it right between you guys. Give me more, Holy Spirit. Nobody is like you. You are very special. You accepted me for the good and the bad and the ugly. I'm sorry I couldn't do the same for you. My heart was blocked. I was not available to receive your love when you gave it. All those secrets I kept caught up with me, each and every last one of them. Mm. Give me more Holy Spirit. You guys, make sure you check out the first one. Okay, part one. I'm so attracted to you. You are the only one that catches my eye. So this is somebody who only has eyes for you. Mm -hmm. You know, even if this person had options before or, you know, was involved with anyone it's like this person doesn't see nobody but you okay they don't even want to deal with anybody but you you are the love of my life i'm ready to spend the rest of my life with you wow <laughs> somebody said you are the love of my life i'm ready to spend the rest of my life with you yeah this person learned from their mistakes somebody said i'm ready to settle down I won't be surprised if the Six of Cups come out. A lot of this could have been in the past. Somebody like, I learned my lessons. I learned my lessons. And that, that is awesome. That is awesome. You know? Something about this person's communication could even be getting better. I feel, I feel you in my bones. Ooh. I said, I feel you in my bones. Sussy, two, two, two. What did you do to this person? This person, I feel you in my bones. This person can't wait to see you again. Person, they feel you in their bones, Sussy. What did y'all do? I am an idiot for losing you. Why did I let you go? This person feels like an idiot for losing you. They said, why did I let you go? Okay. For some of you guys, uh, this person, you guys... This person could have felt like you guys were better off being friends. I feel like that was just a way for them to say that they didn't want to commit, work on themselves, and settle down. This person um, could have made you feel like you guys had too many differences. and Or maybe you guys did. Maybe you guys could be saying, you know, maybe we are better off as friends. You know, take it how it resonates. I wish you knew how much I really miss you. This person wants you to know that they miss you a lot. Give me more, Holy Spirit. Give me more. Give me more. Of course I love you. I will always love you. <laughs> okay. So if I was brother, this person is saying, of course I love you. I will always love you. What's this? I have to stop running away when I'm hurting. Wow. So when this person hurts, they run away. That is the way how for them to cope. Uh, you know what they feel is an emotion there's somebody who doesn't like dealing with it they don't like facing things when things get hard there's somebody who will run and hold <laughs> when things get rough and tough I heard rough and tough for your afro pups hey. <laughs> that's a somebody could wear somebody could be wearing pup puffs that mama pup puffs I used to like that growing up um but yeah, this person is saying, uh, you know, when things get rough for this person, this is somebody who doesn't know how to face their problems. Um, this is somebody who runs from it. I have to break these toxic habits and behaviors. Yes, but I'm glad that they're aware of that, son, Steve. They're saying I have to break these toxic habits and behaviors. When things get tough, this is somebody who, who you know, uh, used to run. Any more Holy Spirit? You are the favorite part of my day. Oh, so I see somebody saying you're the favorite part of their day. Of course my son sees her. 
Somebody say you the favorite part of their day. Will you marry me? Will you spend the rest of your life with me? Wow. Somebody is saying, will you marry me? Will you spend the rest of your life with me? Okay, so see, that's something you and this person got to discuss. You are the greatest love that I ever known. This person never met a love like you. Y'all seen the other, um, in part one, this person said they ain't never loved anyone ever before the way they love you. Okay? No. And it said, I love, um, I love you more than anyone. Yeah. It says, I love you more than anyone, but I failed to show it. Somebody. Who share? This person love y'all a lot. You ain't never got to question that with this person. It's just some toxic um, habits and behaviors that they need to break, you know, that damaged them way before they got with you. Um, and I just feel like you, you were just someone who was like a mirror to them and that what they needed to work on, you know? And this was somebody who wasn't ready to do that. So what they did, they let their pride and their ego lead them astray from this connection, you know? Mentally, I'm exhausted from life right now. So this person is saying mentally they're exhausted from life right now. This person got a lot on their plate. This person is saying I'm feeling emotionally void without you. They saying I have not given up on you, even though it may seem like it. I knew it the whole time. I struggle with revealing my true feelings and emotions. I wish I could have loved you the way you deserve to be loved. I hope you will find forgiveness in your heart for me. I never truly moved on, even though it, it appears so. So the person is saying, they ain't move on. They ain't move on. I one bit. Every song reminds them of you. You are enough and you will always be enough. You are more than enough, sun seeds. Give me more. Give me more, Holy Spirit. Give me more. We should finally talk about everything and clear the air so we can move forward. So this person is ready to talk about everything and clear the air with you guys. Okay. There's somebody who's ready to uh, open up. Okay. For better or worse, I will always choose you. Give me more Holy Spirit. There's somebody who feels like you can't do no wrong in their eyes. Give me more Holy Spirit. I lack accountability and it shows. If you watched the part one, what did I say? You can't halfway take accountability. You can't halfway take accountability. This says I lack accountability in it shows. Give me more Holy Spirit. Give me more. I want to kiss those juicy lips. I fantasize about them. So somebody likes your lips. You can have anything you want from me. This person said, you can have anything you want from them sun seeds. <laughs> I want to make love to you all night long. I pray for your well-being and safety and peace of mind often. So this is somebody um, that prays for you. You are enough and you always will be enough. Your love feels like a warm hug from the heart. Wow. This person feels like your love feels like a warm hug from the heart. Feel good to them, sun seeds. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Anything else? Anything else? Wow. I love you. I love all of you. <laughs> That's what the, they said. I love you. I love all of you. It's you for them, sun seeds. It's you for them. Give me more Holy Spirit on this energy for the collective sun seeds. Wow. Will the fortune queen of cups? This, this person in love. This person is in love. This person feels like they have a um 
it's like it, it, you guys have some type of faded connection like this is a destined partnership like you guys are meant for each other the star card yeah this is somebody who sees you as um very healing the queen of cups of the star very healing very nurturing very loving very kind okay this person is saying your love feels like a warm hug from the heart three of cups I feel like there's a reconciliation here. <clears throat> What's the will of fortune? Will of fortune? Will of fortune? Will of fortune? We have water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and we have the star card. What's that? Aquarius. Yeah. They blocked something they, they was refusing to see Four swords Oh the judgment Okay so spirit is saying What you don't see is that this person Have changed Yeah, This person have changed Two of swords to the four swords They have changed they have healed um, This is somebody who's coming towards you Sunseeds. They made a final judgment It's you for them mm -hmm. Yeah they want to heal this situation. They want to, they, they, this is somebody who feels like you guys have like this faded partnership. Like this person feels like you guys are meant to be together. What you don't see is that this person is coming towards you. Mm -hmm. They already made their final judgment about this. This is somebody who knows what they want. Yeah. Well, that's what you don't see was coming in. <laughs> Give me messages, more messages. Give me more messages. Yeah, somebody also sees you as their peace. Judgment, judgment. They see you as their peace, I see. Yep. Yeah. They coming in with the page of pentacles to offer you a, uh offer you something new, a new beginning. They want a fresh start with you. Okay. But somebody could be worried that if you're gonna reject them or not. Yeah, because of some type of betrayal that they have done to you before. Okay. When they was, you know, um in that toxic energy. You're part of the page of pentacles. Yeah, I can't make it up. Ace of Swords. Spirit said that's the truth. It's like somebody is blaming themselves. They realize that they were the problem, you know, here. You know, they realize that they caused this betrayal between you guys and they worry. You know, um, would you even take them back? Give me a card on the star. The star. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit, the star. Yeah. Two of Pentacles. What's the Two of Pentacles? The five of cups. If this somebody who juggled you, um, took too long to reach out to call you, speak to you, uh, who was sitting somewhere contemplating or indecisive, they regret all of that. Three of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Three of Wands. This is somebody who feels like you could have possibly, you know, turned your back. You're moving forward. You got a bright future. Mm. It's like somebody uh, feels like, um, you know, you might be working with other people, you know. Four of Wands. Stability. The Hangman. Seven of Wands. This person could have definitely juggled you with someone. Maybe they was in another relationship with someone and possibly living with someone um, that could have been blocking this connection. Um, I do feel like um, somebody could um, now be surrendering that or letting that go. Yeah. Yeah, the strength card. Yeah, um, give me a card on the strength. I feel like someone is walking away from uh, sacrificing something in order to have a connection with you. The strength card, seven of pentacles. What's the seven of pentacles, the strength card? Yeah, the love is to the emperor. I cannot make this up to you guys. 
<clears throat> this person chooses you. It was you or somebody else. Somebody is um somebody has something going on with a whole nother connection. Okay. And that could that was definitely the blockage between this connection between you guys moving forward. Because they already had invested somewhere else. They would have to have left that whole situation. But somebody is choosing you. They choosing to work with you. Queen of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. The Sun card. The Justice card. Yeah, somebody was married. Somebody was married. Three of Pentacles. The Sun card. The Justice card. Two of Wands. Yeah, in order for somebody to uh, move forward, they was they had to wait till they get a divorce. Yeah. For some of you guys, you was married to this person. Six of Pentacles, the Page of Cups. Yeah. King of Pentacles. Yeah, they was given to somewhere else. King, Queen, to the Justice. Page of Cups. Somebody was given to a whole nother connection. And, and now somebody wants to come in with the Six of Pentacles. They want to give to you. Possibly somebody wants to um, even buy someone a ring, a gift. Somebody wants to marry you. They see you as the King of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles. They feel like you guys can work together great, great with the Sun card being here. This is somebody who wants, uh, if you reconcile with this person, this person going to uh, uh, propose to you. They see you as their wife or their husband. Yeah. They, yeah. Somebody could even want to go to the courthouse or... You know, or this this is the only way they feel like they can bring justice to this situation with you. Mm -hmm. They want to apologize. Somebody apologize for coming back with a whole ring. A proposal. I'm telling you. Page of Swords, they watch you a lot. What's the two of wands? I feel like whatever this, this decision is, they confident about it. Yeah, Queen of Swords to the Six of uh, to the Six of Cups. Yeah, this was somebody in their past. Whoever this Queen of Swords was, this somebody from their past that they had to let go of. This all happened in the past. Yeah, High Priestess to the Seven of Cups to the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, they leaving somebody out in the cold. Mm -hmm. This could have been somebody who had a lot of options, okay? But they walking away now because somebody is now listening to the intuition when it comes to you. Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups, Seven of Cups. King of Swords. You could have even seen the truth about somebody past. Yeah. You could have found out they were still dealing with somebody else. And you was like, nah, if you're going to be with me, you need to make that choice. But well, they made the choice. King of Swords. Yeah. Eight of Swords. Now, but somebody, is, look, whoever this person is that's rushing towards you, Knight of Swords. Yeah, Eight of Swords. Then they had, because it's somebody who knows that they had options before. Or they... Oh, you know, they betrayed you before in the past with whoever this Queen of Swords is. And now they're afraid of you having new love. Yeah. But they coming in rushing and expressing their feelings. Yeah, Empress, I'm telling you. They coming in expressing their feelings. Empress, Ace of Cup. Yes. Okay. Somebody worried about you finding new love. They trying to rush. The, they trying to rush in. Yeah. Mm -mm. The Nine of Pentacles, the Seven of Swords, and the Chariot. Now, the seven of swords could be somebody who's very cheating, I mean, a cheater, very deceptive. I feel like that's how they was in the past. Whoever this person is, they try to sneak away from this this um, this um energy right here to come towards you. Uh-huh. This somebody who was like withholding, they ain't telling nobody where they going. They just get in their car and leaving. The way they do how this person trying to sneak in their car and go. Let's look, look at the car, the seven of swords, the chair. It's like somebody trying to sneak in their car and go. Hell yeah. This somebody who's single. But they, they, they could know that this person, whoever this, this Queen of Swords and Six of Cups, whoever this person from their past, they're very bitter. Okay? They're very bitter. So this is somebody who's trying to play it smart as they come towards you, Empress. Empress and Emperor. These are, look at you guys. Empress, Empress of the Four of Wands, Twin Flame. Give me more, Holy Spirit. Page of Wands. Somebody sees you as good news. Very inspirational, too. And they want to hold on to you because they're in love with you. You got the King of Cups, Queen of Cups, Emperor, Empress. Yeah, the higher friend. Yeah, somebody wants a, a marriage, a commitment with you. And they've been hurting. Okay, in solitude by themselves. Okay. Somebody could have even snuck away at night. Okay. Mm, Who's the moon card? 
I also feel like the, the, the Hermit to the Three of Swords to the Moon, it's like somebody, you know, it bothers them that they held all of these secrets from you, you know? What's the moon card? The moon? The moon. What are we going to talk about? The moon. Yep. This person who had secrets before, they saying, no, that's over with. To the swords, to the world card, that's over with. There's no more secrets. Whatever they did, whatever they they did, want to whatever they did surrender before, they surrendering now. They letting go whoever this bitter person is from their past. They're closing that cycle out. The tower, yeah, King of Swords. I can't make it up. The Temperance card, divine timing to move forward. Three of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Six of Swords. There's a new beginning here for you, okay? Somebody is finally waking up, okay? And whoever that bitter person is from their past, they're leaving them behind. Somebody could have even came, um, came in between someone's marriage. I mean, soon as it, you know, they didn't even let it lead off the ground, you know, all the way. They just came, you know, that's going to be for somebody. For others of you guys, this person is coming towards you with a proposal. And they could have been with whoever that person is since they was a child, since they was very young. You know? Um, and then whoever that person is, um, they was very bitter. You know? And they was very bitter. Um, and this person could have definitely still had some type of ties with this person that they needed to surrender and let go. But now someone is definitely, um, they see what a problem is. Okay? They see what a problem is. Let's get you guys some signs, and I'm gonna close this out. Give me some signs, Holy Spirit. Give me some signs. Some signs, please and thank you. Sagittarius, Aries. Aquarius. Gemini. Heavy on the air, heavy on fire. Whoever that bitter person from the past, they knew that this person loves you. They was trying to stop them. Yeah, Virgo. <laughs> Give me more. Give me more. This could be their sign or your sign. Leo. Give me one more. Give me one more. And we have Libra and Pisces. I love you, Sun Seeds. I love you guys so very much. Make sure you guys check out part one. And this will be part two. Later.